Hello everybody, I'd like to show you how to properly install these uh, gutter guards. Uh, they're sold to, you know, keep out leaves and stuff. Anyway, I recommend just uh, installing them in one step like that and you're done. Alright, doing a follow up on those uh, rain gutter wedges there and I see that although it's working really well on the rain chains, <laughs> I see like a huge build up on the end there and kind of tough for me to get closer uh, so I'm going to use the zoom on the camera here the rain chains themselves they're running great so clearly they are working no problem there so the problem is definitely I do have a large build up and a huge accumulation of water in the gutters so I'm going to go investigate that probably still have to clean it out a little bit and it's raining right now, I probably won't film the cleaning of the gutter because I'm going to need both hands. Alright, Lord have mercy, you know, it's just, uh, first day of spring so it still feels like that water is uh, liquid ice. So, uh, anyway, uh, it's, it's run for a minute here. I just grabbed the camera immediately afterwards. So, it's just it's just flowing now without the big debris in there so the uh, the level in the gutter should go down all right I still see a big pile of water so I'm gonna have to get up in there and see what's going on all right once it quits raining I'll go up there and film some more but uh, all of the debris is basically you know underneath the wedge so it's 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 kind of built up a little dam there where the wedge comes down into the bottom of the uh, uh, gutter there. So I can I can show you that there. So there's a bunch of debris on top of the rain barrel uh, where I lifted up the wedge and let it run out, and that kind of that stuff kind of spilled out. Uh, so. Uh, so for the ones I can't see, uh, I don't know if I'll be a little more careful. I'll wait till the rain subsides and just go up there and vacuum it out uh, like I did normally. All right, the other side over here gives just a get on camera. The other side over here gives a little bit better view of the debris as they clog up the end. So, but however, this one's not as bad. Of course, I unclogged the other side. But it's those damn pine needles. Anyway, they're they're always the worst. All right. So in the previous storm, I noticed some gutter overflow, and uh, I had installed these gutter guards that I purchased on Amazon. So I'm going to investigate, see why they don't work. Clearly, they don't work. I've seen plenty of videos now that. Uh, show this and here's another one all right so here we are up on the roof looking at the gutter guards and as you can see they definitely keep the debris from going down the gutter and I think I'm gonna just let them go down the gutter <laughs> take these out let the pine needles go it's the pine needles that are the biggest problem All right, well, there it is. As you can see, the leaves just pile up, so it's really just a dam is what it is. So instead of just uh, keeping the leaves out of the drain, which it does, clearly, you know, it just kind of uh, causes a dam, so they aren't worth the crap. So all I have is one big blockage and a waste of money.